Hello everybody. I can't hear myself, now I can hear myself. Welcome back to the channel, boys. Now I look like a mess, I feel like a mess. Probably smell like even worse of a mess. But do you remember a woman, and honestly, I struggle to call her a woman, called Lily Phillips. She um, got plowed by a fair few people. She uh, did something like a, a 10 people or something in 24 hours or something. I can't remember what it was. And she got absolutely plowed. She's an OnlyFans thought. Um, and she just does it just to make, you know, just to be slightly relevant on social media. And it's so embarrassing because imagine being a friend, her family, and you've got to see this woman all over your timeline pl getting plowed by a hundred random people who probably all have fucking illnesses and diseases or herpes wrapped around their penis. She got plowed 101 times, bro, 101 times in 24 hours. She has had the workout of her lifetime. But fair dues, you know, get that bread, whatever, whatever you But what her reaction really disappoints me. She's almost sad. She's almost upset with what has gone on. And I have to just be honest with you. What the fuck? I have no sympathy for you. You've clout chased. You've done nothing but do this for money and fame and trying to be the, the, the first person ever to shag 101 people and film it or something for OnlyFans. You know what I mean? And she made millions or whatever. And then she gets all sad because she doesn't like it. Or maybe I am a bit of a slut. 101 people? Oh, no. But anyway... There's this guy, I can't remember his name. What's his name? Josh Peters. I remember him. I see what he, you know, imagine being this guy. What an even weirder Fruit Loop. I mean, going, yeah, this woman's about to plow 101. I'll just sit in the next door, you know, listening in, seeing what they're doing. And when they're finished, I'll go give her an interview like I'm fucking Jeremy Clarkson on Top Gear. No. When was the last time you ate? Um, I had a, a I think I had a, a yum yum. Um, and I think I had a sandwich. And that was kind of, and then the rest. Oh, God, sorry. Excuse me. So she had a sandwich, a yam yam, whatever that is. It sounds like a, a kid's kids thing. But look at her poor face. I mean, her eyes look like she's been in a hydra, what's it, a chlorine pool for like 24 hours and has just been forced to have her eyes open. No goggles, nothing. She's had enough babies in her eyeballs to cure the population decline problem. She has had so much wasted in her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Not even she can believe it. I mean, scientists must be going fucking nuts. She looks like a defeated woman. I want you to really pay attention to her. <laughs> it's she... not for the weak girls. If is I'm it honest, not? No. it was hot. <laughs> I know, I've just paused it. It's not for weak, not for weak people getting ploughed a hundred times, you know, in the vagina. Uh, if you didn't know, that's how it works. Um, Odd. It's not for weak. Look, she's absolutely destroyed. I don't know if I'd recommend it. Why not? <laughs> I think if you're a different type. <laughs> I don't know if I'd recommend getting ploughed by a hundred people. It's quite demeaning and you kind of feel like shit and a, almost like a prostitute. And how much money did I make? Well, I've made some money. You know, how much money did she make? That's what I want to know. Did she film all this? And if she did, where is it? I need proof that it was 101 people. Girl, it's very like... What's it like? Look at her face. Look, just, I know I keep pausing it, but I want to go there. She looked absolutely like destroyed. Her face looks like she's been beaten in like oblivion. Like she gave a homeless person $5 and then they returned it by be beating her head and then pissing on her like with acid piss or something. Her eyes are destroyed. She can barely string her set. She's like, I don't know if I'd recommend it. No, you wouldn't recommend it, mate. It's kind of like being a warn people in a against sense it. of like, it's just a different... She said she's a prostitute. I said that, you are. Feeling, I don't know how to explain it, like. She's, she's absolutely on a different planet. Has anyone, has anyone been shagged a hundred times, had a hundred shags in a year? Now me, half it, half it again, and minus 24, and that's probably how many I might make it in one year, and that's a PB. But 124 hours, I mean, if you're a man or woman, that is absolutely gonna take its toll on you. And no, I don't feel bad for you, and no, I don't care about this. I am laughing and taking the piss. You look like a sad little girl who's got lost at the park, or like a sad little dog who didn't get given its treats once it had a shit outside because it's too old for that now. You are a thought. You've done this for nothing but clout, money, and fame, and to be some sort of OnlyFans, or, you know, almost like the top OnlyFans person ever, because she was so bothered about, no one's ever done this before. I wonder why. It's not like just having with someone. Yeah, yeah. Just one in, one out. Like, it feels intense. <laughs> Does it? Like, more intense than you thought it might. Intense. Like, sex while camping. In. Tense. I don't know if you can see that. Intense. I'm here all day. Yeah.
full documentary. Holy shit balls. I am watching the full documentary because that would be support and a thought. Look at her face. Look at her eyes. I mean, she is a destroyed woman. Destroyed. But, you know, this is the price for money and fame. You think Beyonce became rich and famous without sacrificing a few... I can't say that. I think sometimes, like, feeling so, like, robotic. Like, by the... I think, by the like... way, these steak ads really piss me off. You don't even get sponsored by them. There's a little bug there following you. Like, why do they post them? Like, the 30th, you know, like, Fuck when off. we're getting on a bit. I've yeah. got like a routine of like how we're gonna do this, and like it just sometimes you'd like disassociate and be Look like. Look at her eyes. She can't. She's like she's pissed off her head. She can't even keep them up, and she don't know what fucking planet she's on. She'd had had that much salt in the system. She's one hundred percent NaCO three, which if you're good at chemistry, which I wasn't, is salt. She is full of sodium right now. She needs to fucking throw herself on some chips or something. Go to McDonald's and say you volunteer to be shredded because you are salty. <laughs> you know, like, it's not, like, normal f***s at all. In my head... I right just... Can we get... So this guy has gone up to her. Oh, my God, you're shagging 100 people. Can I firstly be the 101st? That's uh, going to be in the contract without her knowing. <laughs> but also, can I make a documentary? Because this is, like, the greatest thing ever. You know what I mean? I mean, sure, I'd love to see how Rome was built. Maybe it would be pretty cool to have seen, I don't know, the Eiffel Tower before it arrived or Lady Liberty. I don't know. But what I really want to be a part of is this 101 Men in 24 Hour Challenge. Will you sign here, please, so I can make a full documentary about it? It's tragic. He is not as bad as her, but it is embarrassing. Embarrassing. Right now I can think of, like, five, six guys, ten guys that I remember. Oh, that's and nice. that's it. But it's just, I don't know, it's just weird, isn't it? Like, like, eyes are just if like... I didn't, If I didn't have the videos, I wouldn't have known I've done 100, you know? So she filmed it 100 times. Well, that was the burning question I had to answer. She has got the footage. She can be in it, getting railed 100 times. I wonder what, like, the consequences are. I might go speak to a doctor and say, what happens if a woman gets railed 101 times in the space of 24 hours? Will they die? Will their entire internal organs just fall out because they are just a gaping wide hole now that cannot be filled? I think that was kind of the hard part, is like conversing with 12 them. 12 inches of penis every five and like, seconds. Like when they'd kind of be like, oh, like we've only had two minutes or three minutes and you said five on the message. Did someone say that to you? Yeah. And obviously it just makes me feel so bad. <laughs> Do you think you should feel bad about that? What? I guess when you've promised something to people who support you... Ah, they think they're there to support her. They think they're here trying to make this, like, a, a special. Like, I want to be part of history right now. I want to be part of this new crusade where you shag a hundred... No, they are there because it is funny to do so. They want to be part of this meme and say, yeah, I shagged that bitch. Which, if you did, by the way, you're a fucking degenerate. I'm jealous. But they are not here supporting you like you're their favourite football team or American football team, whatever you want to call it, because they are there for a laugh. Oh, you said I'd have five minutes, but I only got three. You gotta hurry the fuck up, bitch. <laughs> it's kind of hard to yeah. let them down. But, so she but sat to let you, down I these you know, Yeah, things. yeah. Have you even processed, do you think, what's happened? Not yet. <laughs> God, I won't forget this day, Jesus. <laughs> I fucking when I decided well. to start making this documentary, I wasn't too sure of what to expect. I certainly didn't expect to see Lily so upset at the end of it all. <laughs> oh, what a lo what a what a room full of donkeys, if you ask me. What a room full of idiots. Lily Phillips, you are a degenerate, and just because you've done it and now you're going to throw on a few tears and throw on a face does not mean I have any sympathy for you. What you've done is funny, but it's kind of gross. I mean, for, for money and clout, let's not forget. This is not because out of the goodness of her heart she picked 100 virgins to make their day. This is because she wanted to become famous on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, whatever it might be, OnlyFans, as being that girl who shagged 101 people in 24 hours. Now, the sad thing is that is all you'll be remembered for. You are the girl who shagged 100 guys, 101 guys in 24 hours. That's it. Your career is peaked. It is going to go down. You can't do any more than 101 because I think you will die. You clearly look mentally destroyed, mentally fatigued. You are clearly upset and realise what you've done. Hold on. Oh, but... You, my friend, are just the end 
of human civilization. I think she's the epitome of what went wrong. Only fans in all this shit. If you enjoyed, let me know. Would you have dipped your toes in Lily Phillips' gaping wide canyon? Let me know. Um, and if you did and you're subscribed, please unsubscribe. Thank you. Anyway, love you all. Goodbye.